back. We have Erica White, my very favorite fitness guru here today. And how you doing? I'm doing great. Oh, Princess Rebecca, right? Not just Rebecca today. Princess Rebecca. Yes, yes. I, pre I approve this message. <laughs> Yes, I am Princess Rebecca. You know what? I have all boys at my house. And everyone always used to say, wouldn't you want a daughter so that you have a little princess? And I'm like, I'm the oh, princess. I don't spot. need, right, I don't need any usurpers in this house. That's right, hold your, you should make them call you that today for the rest of the day. Yeah, they won't, but they it's won't. true. Try. It's true, I could try. I always I could, try. I always call myself these things in my head. So yes, I'm in Princess Laurel Crown. I, she may not get it back. It looks beautiful. Thank you. All right, so Princess Erica, one thing that we princesses need to do is hydrate. Yes. And it's hard to, first of all, let's talk about there's a certain myth about how much water we're supposed to drink. Right. It is important to drink a lot of water, especially when you're losing weight, but there really is no magic number. There's a rule of thumb. They say eight glasses, six eight ounces. Six, six to eight. Six to eight. Okay. Yes, six, eight, six to eight, eight ounce glasses okay. a day um, is the rule of thumb. When you were in your, I mean, you're in maintenance mode for the most part now. Right. When you were in your biggest weight loss mode, um, I know you did Weight Watchers and all that. So, did you get that amount of water? She's I tried, saying. and I don't. And I'm always very jealous of people. So, if you're out there, I already let you know I'm a lightweight hater because <laughs> I have taste. I do not like the taste of water uh -huh. unless I'm very, very dehydrated. Because, of course, I let myself get dehydrated right. <laughs> before I'll drink water. Right. But it, it's been something I've had to learn to do. But see, this is important. That is the case for a lot of people. That It really is. You have to right. force yourself to have it. And I, like I said, there's no, there's a rule of thumb, but there's no science that says right. this is the amount that will help you it lose It truly weight. depends on where you live, mm -hmm. your age, your activity level. There are a lot of other factors that goes, in, goes into everything. Everything has a rule of thumb. Mm -hmm, how mm -hmm. much fiber you should eat, how much fat you should eat, but everything is specific to who you are. Like we were talking about you, um, you can't eat gluten products. You're totally gluten free. Well, mm -hmm. you're going to be different than I am in weight loss where I'm, I'm going to eat a higher protein diet because mm -hmm. I'm hypoglycemic. Okay. So we're just, so what we've got here is all of these neat ways to drink water. Okay. So that's the thing. I am in total agreement with you that you need to make the water drinking. Sometimes it's boring and it's a slog and you just feel like, Okay, I need to spice this up right. somehow, and make it more fun, just like my princess party, right? Sometimes we right. need to princess up our water, and this is kind of what we're doing. Right. So talk about some and of your best And we're not just going to make it fun here. What we're going to add to this is to give your water a punch. So we're not just adding arbitrary things to our water. We're adding things to our water that are going to make them healthier mm -hmm. and make them fun. So one of the first things um, we're going to go through here is one of my favorites is to make a punch here. And um, what I did is I did it by glass. So, of course, I will give you the cuter one <laughs> because you are the princess today. Yeah. And um, also I brought you a gift today, Rebecca, a water oh, bottle. I so Rebecca this. can start drinking her water. My water from my Fit Zone bottle. That's right. And again, we'll link to ericawhite.net. She is in charge of the Fit Zone. That's right. right. So And now CEO Princess of the fit Rebecca. Zone. CEO. Now, <laughs> I'd rather be CEO of the Fit Zone. Oh, that yes. Good. That sounds much better. Much more power. <laughs> I think my princess days are long, long gone. I don't think so. But these are just lemons mm -hmm. and limes. Very mm -hmm. easy, very simple. So what I've already put in there is a couple strawberries. Mm -hmm. All you want to do is you can load these up in a pitcher for the family, like a pitcher, or you can just drop them in your own water to taste. Because I don't know about you, sometimes I'm busy, I don't have time to make up a pitcher. So we can drop yours, actually a strawberry, mm -hmm. lemon water. And what we're going to do here is just to add the water in there. Okay, you, oh, you have yours. your own I, water. I, I'm working on, like, by the way, uh, this is not, I mean, uh, no one pays me. Gone, I'm impressed. But I've been, yeah, I'm working on this one today. So. No one pays you. No one pays me to drink water. <laughs> I, but I do drink it like it's my job, which you sort of have to do, I guess. All right. All right, so there's your little lovely. This is actually just a spritzer. Okay, cheers. Cheers. And what you can also add in this, mm -hmm. so tell me. Mm -hmm. Light, flavorful. Vodka. There, I, you could do that. No. <laughs> But what you can also do is another trick. What I have here is just a low-fat jello packet. Okay. Oh. Just n not much, just a little. Oh, now that's you don't really want good. it to gel up. I'm going to get a little stirry thing for you. Gives it that nice, look, isn't that pretty? The, you, that's smart. Thank you, Rebecca, stirring, well, with a knife. Well, I don't <laughs> have, I didn't have a swizzle stick. Yeah, so. Right? I need swizzle Look how pretty stick. that is. Cute. And it just has enough, I'm basting it. Ta -da. Excellent. So that's okay. just the idea. So these are actually spritzers. Okay. You get fancy with that. You can drop mint into that. Give it a little extra. You can smell that mint right away. Right away. And just 
you want to play with this. Have fun with it. We'll those are your spritzers. Those look very cute simple. As can be. Now let's say you don't have time and you're like, I just have to get to the store. Mm -hmm. One of my favorite products is this Metro Mint. Again, I don't get paid for this, but I, if they right. want to send me a case, I will take it. <laughs> <laughs> this is excellent. All natural. Nothing's in it. Everything in here from what they flavor it with. Nothing artificial. And I'm going to have Rebecca try this one. This is one of my favorite ones. So when I don't have time, mm -hmm. this is one of my favorite things. So I want There's you to, already a little tiny something something. This is side. Go ahead and try it. Okay. Tell me what you think. There's just a little hint. A little hint of mint. Not little much. Little hint of mint. I like that. But you can also have fun with this and add an extra, again, fresh mint. And well, they say it's good to have your food look like what it's going to taste like. So a little mint lets little people mint. know. You it's got fun. some mint water there. So here's my other favorite one, Princess Rebecca here. Yes. So it's the martini glass, okay? Here we're going to dispose this up. So what I have in here are grapes. This is really a good idea too. This is another fun thing. These are actually ice cube grapes. What I did is taking a twist on the normal just sticking the grapes in the freezer. What I did, and I'll show you one, these are really, really good. I've taken, I've actually put, and I'm going to pronounce, is it nectrice? Am I saying it right? Uh, yeah, nectress, I'm going to go with. It's made from monk fruit, and it's actually an all-natural product. I sprinkle these on top before I put them in the freezer, and then I put a little agave on top. So there's a little cal caloric impact with the agave, but it's the not nectress much. is zero calories, is it? Right. Or, okay. Nothing. Okay. And just a little. I just, one little drizzle. Just to give you something. So I'll eat that one. Yeah. And I'm just going to add water to that. So now I've got a little sweetness to that. And it's pretty. Isn't that pretty? So I do it want you pretty. to try one there. Go in and try. Very simple. Great. Try the water and that. Mm -hmm. Don't make a face. <laughs> no, I'm good. Isn't that good? It's like candy. <laughs> it's like, yes, they're just like, like candy. candy. And you don't have to buy the cotton candy grapes that they're selling. This is mm -hmm. much cheaper. And go ahead and try the water. And of course, I would throw a little more strawberries in that. It's just good. It's good. Just nice and, and neutral. And it's nothing but water, distilled, purified drinking water. That's okay. all I did. So if you want to add a little more here, I've got a couple oranges. You can drop some oranges back into You're my mint really water. You're just really nicely infusing all these things. Just making it look good. And again, every time what I'm adding to the water is nothing artificial, all natural. Just having now, some fun with it. Are you a sipper of water all day, or do like I sometimes say, pretend you're in college, just chug this thing, I just get it chug. done, get it done. I'm not a sipper. I am one of the worst people, and I'm and I'm very honest. I do not like to drink water until I'm dehydrated. And, it's, and, I, and here I am a trainer, but I'm there, an honest trainer. Is, that's right, you are an honest trainer. And there is some research to suggest that that really actually doing your water in one kind of sitting or one you know one hour period, two hour period is beneficial. That, that actually works the best for flushing things okay. out and when you feel like you're retaining water so or whatever. Chug a log, like, you Chug know, <laughs> East Lansing 1988, woo! Oh, drink I will be water. taking that back with me, Rebecca. You can't have that. Darn it all. <laughs> but yeah, chug it. Chug it, baby. Every once in a while, it's good. Just get her done. Yeah. And then you did your water. You know what I mean? And then, right. you're, then you, you did it. You got this, and you're getting down those glasses of water. Now, my also ideas, which you have incorporated here, are I feel that um, water is psycholo psychological. You, you see if this works for you, but okay. it works for me. When you are, fit with. this is fit with right here. I love well, it. Well, uh, first of all, I do drinking games. I do water drinking games. Like if you're at work and someone uses the inner office page, kill it, right? Just like college. Wow, <laughs> right. I like that. Kill it. I mean, any you can make your drinking game with your water. That's all I'm saying. I so like I do that. that, and that's on my website. I'll, I'll link you to that. You Thank you. That's, I need that. But so, anyways, it's psychological. If you are purposefully drinking your water, you are choosing with every glass health you're ch like when you just grab something that's out of perfect the, that's perfect you so to me water is about intent so yeah there's all the nice things about being hydrated but water is about intent i have chosen to drink this water i'm taking a moment to drink it and it is it puts you in your mindful eating phase because for me mindless eating is what gets me in trouble it's what gets right. this here and this here. It's mindful eating, and I'm I'm straight and narrow. Things are good. Right. So to me, if you commit to your water, just even that one day, you're gonna have you are gonna Excellent. stay on track. It's for that your day. health. It's for it you. It is for your health. But it's it's that mental. Okay, I am a paying attention to myself today. So, so all of us and you are um, definitely call in for. What is that? Every Monday you do that? Every, Every Tuesday. Tuesday. That's right. And then, oh, the other thing. So we thing, get to play this game before we call that's in. That's right. Water drinking game. <laughs> My water drink. I have one for the home and one for the office. Well, I'm excited. What do yeah. we do? Well, it's basically just things that happen. I've got a list of things that happen. And when these things happen, that's when you finish your water. 
You know what I'm saying? First, first, I don't you have to pay you a quarter if I don't get it no, done. No, no, right. you and some girlfriends at the office do this, right? Okay. The first one to break the seal, everyone else has to finish their, you know what that I is? I like that. <laughs> Anyways, I'll, I'll send I'll you my water. I'll get those little mini waters that, you know, I'll those send are you little four ounce waters. Game. I will send you my I water. I like that. Drinking game. Yeah, and then the other thing is the, um, I really like the idea of using nice stuff to put your water in. Although, Fun you know, stuff. I'm running around and I've got my water bottle for, you know, it's the mindset, like you, you said, yeah. is getting your mind ready. If I think it's pretty, mm -hmm. I'm going to like it. Or if it looks appetizing. And this, I mean, it looks very appealing, and there's nothing bad in that. And that moves us on to this. This is one of my favorite things we're going to finish up with is tea. Uh -huh. Now, I have, you also always, always want to have organic tea. Okay. What is tea made of? Tea. Water. Leaves. Water. <laughs> oh, tea. Oh, okay. I'm like, <laughs> well, those are leaves. Water. Right. There you go. <laughs> I'm thinking of leaves. It's okay. You're excited about this. Yeah, I'm like, Well, what? smell, smell good. That smells. It smells really good. This is actually an all organic um, Mediterranean tea. I uh -huh. actually got from um, Tiger ba Bakery here locally. And it's actually one of the best ways to do your tea because it's all natural. It's just leaves. So you just put it in your little teapot? I'm just going to put it in my teapot. I gotta, where's the opening? There we go. Sorry, there we go. And I'll drop it in there. Perfect. If I'm not going to do that, then I can buy organic teas. Mm -hmm. Again. Do you do hot tea sometimes? Yes. You can do hot or iced either way. This is another great way to get your water in. Again, have fun with it. We have the little princess cups <laughs> that I absolutely love. Again, keep moving this down. Throw some mint in there. Make it fun. You also, instead of using some of your sweeteners, try agave. It, you only need just a little just Very to sweeten. Sweet. And then you've got a little almond milk. Is that right? A little almond milk. I actually like to add that to my tea. It gives it like a chai tea. Excellent. Just a little of that little sweetener. And you've look. got, look how much you've built into just your water. Perfecto. All right, we're going to link you to Erica's website and uh, my water drinking game, my totally inappropriate dieting. That's what I do, nice. right? Stay with us. We are going to make a uh, skinny pumpkin pie. Ooh, yeah. that sounds good. It is. It is. Um,